Sometimes you may want to show where to find information on a form, map, photo or document. And the hot graphic interaction is an efficient way to demonstrate this. A hot graphic usually consists of a large image being displayed with a number of hotspot markers that the user selects to see further information related to the hotspot they've selected. To create a hot graphic interaction, first you need to scroll down to the bottom of the existing course content and select to add a block. And then you need to add a component. From the list of components, select the hot graphic interaction and then you can choose how it will display. Here, we'll select Add Full, which means the interaction will stretch the width of the page. Then you click the cog and choose Edit to add your content. From here, you need to add your instruction text and select your image. Once that's done, you need to add your marker and the details for when the learner selects the marker, such as title, content and strapline text for display on mobiles. You'll need to specify the position for each marker or pin you add a number for the left and a number for the top positions. It's worth knowing these are a percentage. So for example, if you make it 40 left and 20 top, your marker will sit 40% from the left of your image and 20% from the top of your image. It's a good idea to map the marker positions on your original image to assist with this. Otherwise, it's a bit of trial and error to get the positions right. Okay, let's see what this one looks like. Here, you can see the hotspot information icon markers. When I select a hotspot, you get the information pop-up. You can choose to navigate via the arrows or return to the image to click the next hotspot. If you need any graphic design assistance, visit the My Enhancements section within the main menu area and schedule some support time.